all right boys and girls welcome to the video in this video tutorial series i would be uh, teaching you guys how to use the google developer api we would be using google sheets uh, for this example i will be uh, making sure that you guys are comfortable right from the scratch i would be showing you how to get the api key and um, you know getting started with the google uh, spreadsheet api so guys what are you waiting for let's get started so my name is shah and i will be teaching you today about the various google uh, api so so far we have learned about the youtube data api we have learned about the bloggers api and now we are learning the google sheets api so let's get started so first of all you have to do is go to console.developer.google.com create an account i already have one so i'm not supposed to do that so this is tutorial number one by the way so i'm gonna just walk you through that so you want to go to the library section section <clears throat> so just in case if you don't see this option so you can go to the navigation bar right you go to the api services and you can go to the dashboard once you come to the dashboard, right, all you want to do is basically you want to go to the library, right? So make sure to go to the library section. So this is the tutorial one, right? So uh, let it load. So once it loads, uh, you want to scroll down and look for the Google uh, Sheets API. So here you can see the Sheets API gives you full control over the content and appearance of your spreadsheets. So that's the one you want to uh, select so make sure to click on that once you do that there will be an off button uh, saying enable so make sure you enable that very good guys congratulations with that now again go to the navigation bar now we need an api key to do that so i'll go to the credentials right i already have certain credentials here so i'm gonna what, what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna create a, a new credential i'm gonna delete all these credentials so that i can walk you through uh, complete step by step uh, remember it's gonna take time uh, i can say you have to specify delete right so let me do that quickly for the rest two as well so i'm gonna say delete i hit the delete button i have to specify right delete and I'm gonna say delete so right now this is what your screen should look like so what you want to do guys is gonna go to create credentials you want to select the first uh, option that is api key remember you can also set like policies so here is your api key so copy that you can go to the restrict section uh, i'll explain you what restrict section does um, it's basically just for restricting the access so so application restriction so you're using an https or only certain ip address should get the access so here you can see the uh, do not restrict the api you can say restrict api you can also um, set um, excuse me i'm sorry for that so you can set restrictions here um, we will not be doing any any of that so what you want to do is just going to copy the credential and want to open your uh, jupyter notebook i already have a lot of beautiful examples lined up for you so in tutorial number two we would be diving into action with python and um, uh, google uh, spreadsheet api so guys thank you for watching part one uh, make sure to see my part two and hope you will um, uh, enjoy this tutorials and i'll i will be making sure that i go very slowly step by step and yep as usual, if you have any question, this is please post your questions in the comment section below. This is your host Shah. Uh, thank you for watching this video. See you guys in the tutorial number two.